Ahmad Shah Abdali, also known as Ahmad Shah Durrani, was a military leader and founder of the Durrani Empire in modern-day Afghanistan. He is considered a significant figure in Afghan and South Asian history due to his contributions to the consolidation of Afghan power and his role in the Battle of Panipat. This video will explore the life and accomplishments of Ahmad Shah Abdali in detail. Early Life Ahmad Shah Abdali was born in 1722 in the Kandahar province of Afghanistan. He was part of the Sadozai clan of the Papalzai tribe, which was one of the largest and most powerful Pashtun tribes in the region. His father, Muhammad Zaman Khan Abdali, was the governor of Herat at the time of Ahmad Shah's birth. As a young man, Ahmad Shah was trained in the art of warfare and military tactics by his father. He quickly demonstrated his prowess as a military leader and participated in several successful campaigns against rival Afghan tribes and the Persian Empire. He also fought alongside Nader Shah, the powerful Persian ruler, in his campaigns against the Mughal Empire in India. Rise to Power in 1747, after the death of his father, Ahmad Shah Abdali was declared the new ruler of Afghanistan by the tribal chiefs. He began consolidating his power by defeating and subduing rival Afghan tribes and expanding his territory. By 1751, he had conquered Kandahar, Herat, and Kabul, thus establishing the Durrani Empire. Over the next few years, Ahmad Shah Abdali focused on securing his hold on his newly acquired territory. He implemented several reforms aimed at strengthening his army and government, including the establishment of a strong central administration and a new taxation system. He also reorganized the army, adopting new tactics and technologies to make it more efficient and effective. Campaigns in India In 1757, Ahmad Shah Abdali turned his attention to the Mughal Empire in India, which was in a state of decline and was facing several challenges from rival Indian powers. Ahmad Shah saw an opportunity to expand his empire and increase his wealth and power by invading India. He launched several campaigns into India over the next few years, capturing several important cities and defeating the armies of various Indian rulers. In 1761, he faced his biggest challenge yet when he clashed with the Maratha Empire in the Battle of Panipat. The Battle of Panipat The Battle of Panipat was a major conflict between the Durrani Empire and the Maratha Empire, which was the dominant power in India at the time. Ahmad Shah Abdali led a massive army of over 100,000 soldiers, while the Marathas fielded an even larger force of around 150,000 soldiers. The battle was fought on January 14, 1761, and was one of the bloodiest in Indian history. After several hours of fierce fighting, Ahmad Shah Abdali emerged victorious, thanks in large part to his superior military tactics and the discipline of his soldiers. The aftermath of the battle was devastating for both sides. The Maratha Empire suffered a significant loss of manpower and resources, and the Durrani Empire was unable to effectively consolidate its gains due to internal power struggles and the resistance of local Indian rulers. Later Years and Legacy After the Battle of Panipat, Ahmad Shah Abdali continued to rule over the Durrani Empire for another two decades. He maintained his focus on consolidating his power and expanding his territory, launching several campaigns against Indian and Persian rivals. He died in 1772 at the age of 50, leaving behind a powerful and centralized Afghan state that would continue to play a significant role in South Asian and Middle Eastern politics for decades to come. Ahmad Shah Abdali is remembered for his military and political achievements, as well as his contributions to Afghan culture and society. He was a patron of the arts and literature, and he encouraged the development of Pashtun culture and traditions. He is also remembered for his legacy of religious tolerance and his commitment to promoting peace and stability in the region. He allowed Hindus and Sikhs to practice their religion freely in his territories, and he worked to establish good relations with neighboring states and rulers. However, his legacy is not without controversy. Some historians criticize his military campaigns, particularly his invasions of India, as unnecessary and brutal. Others argue that his rule was marked by corruption and abuses of power. Regardless of these criticisms, Ahmad Shah Abdali remains an important figure in Afghan and South Asian history. His legacy continues to influence politics and culture in the region today, and his contributions to the consolidation of Afghan power and the promotion of religious tolerance and cultural development cannot be ignored. Ahmad Shah Abdali was a significant figure in Afghan and South Asian history, known for his military and political achievements and his contributions to culture and society. 
He rose to power in Afghanistan in the mid-18th century and established the Durrani Empire, which became a major power in the region. He is remembered for his military campaigns, particularly his invasions of India, as well as his reforms aimed at strengthening his army and government. He also encouraged the development of Pashtun culture and traditions, and he worked to establish good relations with neighboring states and rulers. Despite his controversial legacy, Ahmad Shah Abdali remains an important figure in the history of Afghanistan and South Asia. His contributions to the consolidation of Afghan power and the promotion of religious tolerance and cultural development have left a lasting impact on the region. Thank you for watching. For more informative videos please subscribe to my channel Knowledge Hub.